वेलकम टू शेखर मैथ्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न सेवेंथ क्लास मैथमेटिक्स सेमिस्टर वन फिफ्थ चैप्टर ट्रयांगल्स एक्सटीरियर ऐंगि प्रापर्टी एक्सरसाइज फाइव पॉइंट थ्री एक्सटीरियर ऐंगि प्रापर्टी आफ ए ट्रयांगि फॉर दिस लैट एस डू एन एक्टिविटी ड्रा ए ट्रयांगि ए बी सी एंड एक्सटेड बी सी अप टू डी देन एंड एक्सटीरियर ऐंगि ऐंगि ए सी डी विल बी फॉर्मड अट द वर्ट एक्स सी Clearly, angle BCA shown in green color is an adjacent angle to exterior angle. The remaining two angles are angle A shown in red color and angle B shown in blue color. Here, angle A and angle B are the two interior opposite angles of the exterior angle, angle ACD. Now, cut out angle A and angle B. First, cut the trace of angle B shown in blue color and place it adjacent to angle C shown in green color. Now, cut angle A and place it adjacent to the blue color. Now, observe that these blue and red colors, that is angle A, angle B pieces together entirely cover the external angle, angle ACD. So we can say that angle ACD is equal to angle A plus angle B. So from the above activity we can say that an exterior angle of a triangle is equal to the sum of its opposite interior angles. Now we can prove this property as follows. Statement. An exterior angle of a triangle is equal to the sum of its interior opposite angles. Given that in triangle PQR, angle PRS is an exterior angle and angle P and angle Q are the interior opposite angles. To prove angle PRS is equal to angle P plus angle Q, we have to construct a line parallel to PQ bar that is RT bar. Since RT is parallel to PQ bar, Angle 1 is equal to angle 3. Equation 1. Because alternative angles are equal which are shown in blue color in the figure. Now, angle 2 is equal to angle 4. Equation 2. Because corresponding angles are equal which are shown in red color in the figure. Now, by adding equation 1 and 2, we get angle 1 plus angle 2 is equal to angle 3 plus angle 4. Now observe that in the figure angle 3 plus angle 4 shows the angle angle PRS. Now left side angles angle 1 shows angle P angle 2 shows angle Q. Here angle PRS is an exterior angle and angle P plus angle Q is the sum of its interior opposite angles. Thus. The exterior angle of a triangle is equal to sum of its interior opposite angles. Now let us do check your progress. Find the value of x in the given figure. Solution. Observe that in triangle AHC, external angle is equal to angle HAT. So angle HAT is equal to angle H plus angle C because Exterior angle is equal to sum of its opposite interior angles, where angle H is equal to 60 degrees, angle C is equal to 80 degrees, which gives 140 degrees, because 60 plus 80 gives 140 degrees. Now in triangle TAE, external angle is equal to angle HAT. Now angle HAT is equal to angle T plus angle E, because using exterior angle property in a triangle. Exterior angle angle HAT is equal to 140. Interior angles angle T is equal to X and angle E is 70 degrees. So X plus 70 degrees is equal to 140 degrees. So X is equal to 140 degrees minus 70 degrees. So X is equal to 70 degrees because 140 degrees minus 70 degrees gives 70 degrees. So, the value of x is equal to 70 degrees is the answer.
Now let us do exercise 5.3 first problem write the exterior angles of triangle xyz solution by extending the side xy up to q we get the exterior angle is angle zyq by extending the side yz up to r we get the exterior angle is angle xzr by extending the side zx up to p we get the exterior angle is angle yxp so these are the exterior angles now second problem find the exterior angles in each of the following triangles solution using exterior angle property of a triangle in the first figure exterior angle angle acd is equal to sum of the interior opposite angles angle a plus angle b where angle a is 60 degrees angle b is 73 degrees which is equal to 133 degrees because 60 plus 73 gives 133 degrees now in the second figure angle d trace is in square shape so it shows 90 degrees using exterior angle property the exterior angle angle dfr is equal to sum of the interior opposite angles angle d plus angle e that is equal to 90 degrees plus 30 degrees which is equal to 120 degrees because 90 plus 30 degrees gives 120 degrees now third problem find the value of x in the following figures solution using exterior angle property of a triangle in the first figure sum of the interior opposite angles angle a plus angle r is equal to exterior angle angle acd so 35 degrees plus x is equal to 70 degrees because angle a is 35 degrees angle r is x and angle acd is 70 degrees then x is equal to 70 minus 35 degrees so x is equal to 35 degrees because 70 minus 35 gives 35 degrees now in the second figure sum of the interior opposite angles angle p plus angle q is equal to exterior angle angle prs where angle p is 4x angle q is 3x the exterior angle angle prs is equal to 119 now 7x is equal to 190 degrees because 4x plus 3x gives 7x now x is equal to 119 by 7 on simplification by 7 7 17 times so the value of x is equal to 17 degrees now let us do fourth problem if the exterior angle of a triangle is 110 degrees and its interior opposite angles are x degrees and x plus 10 degrees find the value of x solution by exterior angle property of a triangle we know that sum of interior opposite angles is equal to exterior angle here x degrees plus x plus 10 degrees is equal to 110 degrees where x degrees is the first interior angle x plus 10 degrees is the second interior angle and sum indicates plus now 2x plus 10 degrees is equal to 110 degrees because x plus x gives 2x degrees now 2x is equal to 110 degrees minus 10 degrees so 2x is equal to 100 degrees because 110 minus 10 degrees gives 100 degrees now x is equal to 100 degrees by 2 on simplification by 2 to 50 times so that is equal to 50 degrees so x is equal to 50 degrees is the answer now fifth problem find the values of x and y in each of the following figures solution one in the first figure in triangle abc exterior angle is equal to x exterior angle x is equal to sum of the interior opposite angles that is 40 degrees plus 60 degrees using exterior angle property now x is equal to 100 degrees because 40 degrees plus 60 degrees gives 100 degrees now in triangle ecd the exterior angle is equal to y now exterior angle y is equal to sum of the interior angles x plus 
45 degrees using exterior angle property. Now, y is equal to 100 plus 45 degrees because x is equal to 100 degrees. So, I'll write 100 degrees in place of x. Now, y is equal to 145 degrees because 100 plus 45 degrees gives 145 degrees. So, x is equal to 100 degrees and y is equal to 145 degrees. Now, let us do solution 2. In the second figure, in triangle LMN, exterior angle is equal to 120 degrees. So, in the figure, y plus 70 degrees is equal to 120 degrees. Because sum of the interior angles y plus 70 degrees is equal to exterior angle 120 degrees. Using exterior angle property, now y is equal to 120 degrees minus 70 degrees. So, y is equal to 50 degrees because 120 minus 70 gives 50 degrees. Now, observe that in the figure, the angles x and y lie adjacent angles and they lie on the same line. So, their sum is equal to 180 degrees because sum of the linear pair of angles is equal to 180 degrees. Now, x plus 50 degrees is equal to 180 degrees because y is equal to 50 degrees. So, write 50 degrees in place of y. Now, x is equal to 180 minus 50 degrees. So, x is equal to 130 degrees because 180 minus 50 degrees gives 130 degrees. So, x is equal to 130 degrees and y is equal to 50 degrees. Thanks for watching video. Don't forget to subscribe.